Hello YouTube, welcome back to the Web Gear Review. I'm your host, Web Gear Guy, and I want to thank you for watching. Today, I would like to uh, take a look at the Field Pack Canvas Combat M1961 Pack. The federal stock number on this baby right here is uh, 8465. Six three seven six two two. Now, basically, a lot of people refer to this as the M nineteen fifty six second pattern, but actually, it was uh, had its own designation and its own federal stock number. The stock number is different than the M nineteen fifty six pack. So, it wasn't but five short years into the use of the M1956 field pack when they realized it had some shortcomings. One of them was it was definitely too small and the other one was it wasn't very waterproof. So they made some improvements with this pack here. So basically this is the, the, the new design and you can see what the changes were. Okay, first of all, look at this flap, the lid. They added to the flap where it covered the pack uh, better like that. It had these right here uh, on it. Uh, the first version had some eyelets also. But anyway, you could hang things off of there. And uh, they made this pack larger. This pack is larger probably by an inch in all directions. Now, another big change from the 1956 to the M1961 pack is let me show you we'll get it opened up here is mainly the flap notice it still has the name plate still has the handle on it it still has virtually the same things that the other one has the eyelets for hooking to the spenders it has the uh two side keepers it still has the straps to hang the poncho or whatever you need to hang on the bottom but however you pull this stuff in out of here they put a rubberized sleeve in it. Just kind of like the rubberized sleeve that they had put in the M1945 combat field packs. Now the M1961 has this rubberized sleeve, which made this pack, in fact, uh, more waterproof and more uh, weather resistant from the elements. Now, this particular pack here, like I said, let me see if I can get that up there to you. It was made in 1969, and uh, it was made by Land Manufacturing Incorporated. Hopefully, you can see that. Now, there is one thing I would like to draw to your attention here that I've noticed. Notice the design. The M1956 pack was more of a rectangle. This pack here is more of the teardrop shape, which reminds me a lot of the M19, I mean, uh, the M1936 Musette bag. Notice how it's teardrop shaped like that. See, so this is very similar in shape wise to the old Musette bag. In World War II, look at that. Look at the shape of it. But anyway, this is the M1961 Combat Field Pack. And I want to thank you for watching tonight. And I also want to let you know that I've been very busy. I'm trying to get some videos out. It's just, uh, it takes a little of my time. And I have Buku Web Gear. So there's no shortage of web gear to show. It's just I got to get to the time when I can show it. So hang in there with me. Uh, share and like these videos. And uh, thanks for watching the Web Gear Review.